It's time for the greatest athleticism you've ever seen in your life. The pros and the leagues are shaking in their boots. With all the videos out there of talented bowlers showing their stuff, there's this series, as it is now time to watch me suck at bowling. Welcome to week number three of five for the month of January 2019. And watch me suck at bowling. Coming to you from Mason's Lemonster Mass, the easiest candle pin house in the world. And we're bowling on 16, which has not treated us very well. And speaking of such, not exactly shattering records here. If you saw the last episode, you know how games one, two, and three went. We're concentrating on number four, but we're keeping them all in frame in case you want to stop and see everything. Lousy start. No stick frames though. Barely missed it by one there. Got an 86 thanks to a seven fill and a spare. So can we get at least four of the seven games to be good? Let's find out. Watch Me Suck at Bowling is a proud sponsor of the hit TV candle pin show, King of the Palace. Watch talented professional and league bowlers show their stuff instead of watching this crap. To watch episodes of King of the Palace, simply go to YouTube and search for King of the Palace. If you want to subscribe to the show, go to youtube.com slash new palace lanes. Frame one, ball one. <laughs> Okay. Ball two. If I hit that piece of wood, I could probably make that conversion. Ball three. Hey, from goalposts, we'll take a niner. Now, for those of you who like the pin setters, here's the bowl more in action. And there you go. Frame two, ball one. He's cheating. I Ball two, going for the Emily. That's when you miss everything on the first ball and you get them all in the second. Emily, where are you going? Ball three, again, a little too full. And a wonderful six. The start is a little weak, but it's not all that bad. We got a nine and one, and we got a six and two. A 15 so far, which is still okay. Can do better, but it's not too bad. Frame three, ball one. Zero, zero. Ball two, welcome to Masons. Ball three. King pin remains for none. Frame four, ball one. Yes. Ball two. The usual story, big opportunity, always ruined. Seven. 
This is a repeat of the previous two frames, except one pin better. A 9 and 3, and a 7 and 4 instead of 6. 31. Still doable. Frame 5, ball 1. Ball two. Ball three. Another welcome to Mason's moment. Niner. Frame six, ball one. Ball two. Ball three. Figures. Down the toilet we go with a seven. Rinse and repeat. Nine and five, seven and six, 47. You gotta do better than this. This game might not be a good one after all. Frame seven, ball one. Ball two. Either hit the two pieces or the wood. Ball three. Too far to the right to make it work. <laughs> Time for the balls to be cleaned after this game. Nine. Ball one. Hey! 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 The dream is dead. Seven. Deja vu. Nine. Seven. Sixty-three. Gotta break this pattern or the game is probably not gonna work out. Frame nine ball one. I got a few more. Seven. Last frame, ball one. Ball two. We need that pin to hit bottom of average. Watch me missing. The game's a mediocrity failure. Yeah, I thought it was going right down the middle. I tell you, I can call it. Mission failed a nine. Well, this time it was different. This time the first frame is a seven, and then the second one is a nine. And that's making this game a 79, which makes it less than average ability. If it wasn't for the six box in frame number two, then 
things would have been different. We would have just barely have made it, but it would have been different. That concludes week three of five for the month of January 2019's edition of Watch Me Suck at Bowling. From Mason's Bowling Center in Leominster, Massachusetts, this is George F551 saying hope you enjoyed and have a good one.